Okay, hi again, this is Bandla Basics 3. So this is just to do exercise number seven here. So this is to complete the C major scale exercise. Um, this is the assignment brief. I'm gonna click that off. Um, I'm gonna mute the track, this Taz, TTs and Ticket Tickets track that we've done and mute that. Um, and I'm gonna unmute the C major scale track. This is our number seven, okay? I can press um, X that one, because that was that exercise. And then I'm gonna double click on this one. Okay, so you can, I'm gonna, you can see here these notes are not all on the same line. They're kind of going step by step up, which is what uh, what we recognize as a scale. I'm gonna zoom out a little bit so that you can see what's going on here. Um, let's have a listen. Okay, so you can hear the C major scale all going up um, and in crotchets as well. So we've just got same length of notes and they take up um, two of these little boxes. You I've zoomed out so you can't see the beats here, but each of these is essentially a beat. All you need to do is copy that. Okay, so when you when you are going up the scale, a C major scale only uses white notes. So you can actually see that, obviously if you go across here, check it, it says it's on C. Okay, now only the C's on the keyboard are actually labeled, but we can work out what every other note is and it's handy on the grid here because the lighter shade are the white notes and the darker shade are the black notes. Okay, so we can avoid, C major scale does not have any black notes in it. So we avoid those, okay? And we just use the lighter shaded notes, okay? Now that's C. The next one up then is D of course, E, F, G, goes back to A, B, and then C again. They're the notes you want and you just wanna put them step by step exactly like this. You'll notice um, that between E and F, they're next door to each other because they're a semitone apart. There's no black note in the middle, but they're same here for B and C. Okay, so just be careful of that. Um, I've got my C already in. I'm just gonna pop a D in. It's too short, it's a quaver. I'm gonna make it a crotchet, okay? There's my E, there's my F, semitone apart. They're next door to each other. There's no black note in between. Uh, G, there's my A. There's my B, I'm avoiding all of the darker lines because they're black notes. And finally C at the top, okay. I can change my tempo up a little bit so we can listen to it nice and quickly. And then I'm gonna press play. Okay, good, so I actually copied that perfectly. It sounds the same, it looks the same. And then you are done. The last thing I'll show you actually is just um, this and you probably would have noticed it before as well just make sure that you press save and um, you don't actually need to press um, submit on your project okay you just need to save it so that we can um, so that you, you don't lose your work and um, but you don't need to submit it actually just save okay thank you